YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Mile High Chosen One, and we are back here with another video of today. In this video, man, I'm going to show you guys how to consistently beat a cover two and a cover three uh, with just simple route combinations. Um, the combination routes will be a corner route with a fade route or a streak route with it. Um, this route, man, you guys probably already use it in your daily uh, Madden games, but um, it's very important to the people who don't know how to use it. So we're going to come out in a formation with a corner route. You could do it. You could do this in any formation with a cover with a corner route in it. Just make sure you incorporate a fade or a streak. And we're going to come out in a cover three. So right now, this is the typical way that I, I see a lot of people running it. And there's nothing wrong with this way. They just put two streaks in between it and they run it just like that. But the smart way to run it or the best way to run it is to have them corner routes on the outside and have your streak or your fade in the inside. And it make more sense to have it like that because the corner route will get to the open spot way faster. So do you see this is a bent switch? You know what I'm saying? So I had a corner route on the outside and as you will see, it gets to the spot extremely fast. And this beat cover two and cover three. So just watch. And you can see X is wide open. Now, it, it, it will work the other way with the corner route and the inside and the streak on the outside, but it would be way slower. This is the fastest way to do it. Uh, we're going to do it again. Streak routes to the inside or fade routes to the inside and corner routes on the outside on both sides. This is very hard to cover in the cover three or cover two. Wide open. You know, some of these um, can be taken for one play touchdown. Um, I advise you to run these um, on the wide side of the field. It's the best way to do it. You know, this is a good, I mean, this is a great way to do it as well. I'm going to show you this way. But do you see how slow it takes? It's, it's running into people. You don't want all that. It still get open, but you want it the other way. So nobody have to run into nobody or anything. So let's go back to the regular bench switch. Uh, fades in the inside. Corner routes on the outside. And if you look, it's wide open. Possession catch on the sideline. Remember, run it to the wide side of the field. That's cover three. Now let's do the same thing and let's go to a cover two. Cover two works um, the best um, to me. Um, it worked be best in both, but cover two works the best. And the only thing you want to do is you just want to anticipate that corner dropping down because the corner will drop down. Even th if he in a cloud flat, the corner going to sink back so far that he's going to automatically drop down. So just pay attention. Um, corner routes on the outside, fades on the inside. And you just throw it if you see. Well... Pass rush. Let's do it again. Fades or streaks on the inside. Quite. And that corner just happened to drop down. And you just hit it. The corner didn't drop down that much. I don't know what happened. You know, practice mode is, is like very weird. But in a game, that corner would drop down every single time if you just uh, be patient. Um, let's do it again. Wide open. Remember, run it to the wide side. And I would just say, look for any formation with corner routes and create your own route combination. Do it again, drop back, just watch. Throw it to the other side. See, on that side, the corner dropped down on that side. But in the game, the corner always dropped down because they're in cover two. They have to, uh, they're gonna keep sinking until somebody attack their flats. All right, now let's try it in another formation. Just to let you guys know, it works in every formation with a corner route. You just have to create it. Um, so let's look through. Let's go to smash pivot. And let's go to a cover three. Now to create that concept, if you can see, I can run it just like that, but we don't want that. So what we'll do is we're going to motion X in so the corner route could be on the outside and X could be in the inside. And it's going to work out the same. And you're going to see Y is just wide open. Uh, that was kind of a tight, tight squeeze. I'm going to do it again. Line it back up. Um... Like I said, do this to the wide side of the field. Let me scoot it over. Do it to the wide side of the field if you want to hit it to the side to make it uh, more dangerous. So X, motion him in. So as you get close, call, snap the ball. And then you're going to see just Y screaming open to the sideline, just like that. So always have the corner route to the outside and put the streak or the fade in the inside. Do it again. Motion him over. Just like that, just be patient. Got sacked, that's all right. Do it again, line up. Fade, motion him in so he can be on the inside. Be patient. 
and then wide just like that. Like I said, you can house these sometimes too if you got some fast receivers. Um, now let's go to cover two. Mind you, you do it in anything. A lot of people like to run in a gun bunch and stuff like that. Fine gun bunch, you do the Z spot, and make sure you just put the inside uh, tight end on the fade row. But we're going to go to the same formation we just left out of and run out of cover two. Uh, it's fine, it's smash pivot. Uh, let's go to nickel cover two. Like I said, doing these routes is best to go against cover two. Um, get your opponent out of cover two um, real fast running this. You're going to see why. Wide open. You know, just anticipate that corner dropping down because eventually he will drop down. He can't he, he can't sink back too far when he in cover two. I don't care if he in hard. I mean, I don't care if he in cloud flats. Um, sometimes a lot of people like to play hard flats, and that, that's what kills it even more. But you see the corner come down a little bit. That's exactly what you're looking for. It's gonna be wide open. You know, this play. Well, not even this play. Just find any route combination with a corner route is the best thing on the game. You know, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm going to be coming back to you guys uh, with a video real soon. I appreciate you guys for watching.